Hello, today I will show a presentation of using radio fingerprinting to identify the radio in a cognitive radio network. This is our test bed, and we have uh, two USRPs and have a two Motorola walkie-talkie and have a signal generator uh, to generate a AWGN signal and we integrated our algorithm in this oscilloscope and we use uh, a computer to control the USRP which send the same signal to the walkie-talkie okay and the USRP is controlled by the computer is controlled by the computer and then on this side okay this is our stellar scope and we will do that say so shrink this one and we open a MATLAB In the my life, we just uh, extend the desktop to here. We open our program. It's written by my life, and we run it. See here. We open up window and we give this window to here so this is a radio behavior and fingerprinting identification system they have two functions first let's define the radio type say it's a primary radio or secondary radio and it will give you the radio ID say it's a terminal 1 or terminal 2 okay I will show you guys the demo so basically we back to the setter scope and we click this this button and before we click we saw the walkie talkie we use okay have the exactly same definition and we click this one and it's waiting for a signal and we find the walkie talkie here to run it see here it's a waiting for a signal and then a signal is detected and processing we can see the processing result from here So now the class ID is ID1. Okay, this is a this radio. So and another radio. We give it a label. So this is the ID2. Okay. And we go back to here and click this one. And then the stellar clock is waiting for a signal. We also we also click a signal. Here that is processing. The MATLAB is running. You see the class ID is 2 right now. So that's our demo. Thank you for watching. Yeah. So that's for basically is for the uh, radio terminal identification and for the identify the primary user. We think about this as a primary user. And we think the USRP as the secondary user.